Off a day, I'm Claire Smith bringing you your daily renewal. Today I'm here at the American Medical Center in Upper Tumon with Dr. Vince Ekamoto. Thank you, Doctor, for affording us your time and your busy schedule. Sure. And um, so we're here to talk about your personal regimen of, of keeping healthy. For us, as well as for the patients that we see, um, it's it's never a matter of lack of pills. That I think when, when somebody's sick, they come in. It, it, it's not that they're missing some pills. They think they're missing some wellness or something, something that's going to keep them healthy despite the cancer that they have, the heart disease that they have, the diabetes that they have. I think enough research has been done to show now that depression definitely accelerates disease and happiness seems to be an antidote at least to some of the problems that disease brings like like um, giving up, so mm -hmm. not taking your, your medication, not complying. Why, why would you want to get a treatment, especially one that's hard, if you don't really feel like living anyway? So getting depressed is a real difficult thing and so having um, spiritual strength, having good friends around you, having family members who lift you up, mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's all part of the wellness package. Are there any therapies, like complementary therapies that you practice? I, I don't practice it itself, I wish I, I knew it better, one is massage because touch therapy is such a big part of a lot of people getting better but fortunately we have a, quite a number of our partners who are, so people that we know that in the community that do it at a high level who we refer to. Chiropractors, although that's not exactly massage, do something very similar. Mm -hmm. And then acupuncturists, and we have Dr. Richard Chong next door, who's been somebody that we've been turning to. So he does both acupuncture and acupressure, and he does also teach people to do it. So we've got a lot of pe people in the community who are doing things uh, very well. We understand that there are more hypnotherapists coming to Island, so we'll see what you know they add to the package. There's a lot of good things going on on mm -hmm. Island that um, augment or complement the kind of medical care that you get in a regular medical clinic. We're already seeing that behavioral health specialists, mental health specialists, mm -hmm. and primary care physicians are coming together and it's working. Um, you have orthopedic surgeons working with a physical therapist and with the, uh, the yoga instructors to try to have therapies that are going to uh, help the healing along. Right. So I think it is happening as we speak, Great. but m the more the, I think the more that it happens, the more quickly it happens, the better one will be. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. All right, so any last words of health advice you'd like to share with our viewers? I think people get, should get outside after they watch this show. They should make sure that you have spend some time walking and, and, and being out, on, on one does involve being at the beach, uh, being, being in, in the playgrounds and being out in the hills to go hiking. This is a really great time of the year to, to explore Guam and so we advise people to do that. Thank you so much. Okay. And thank you. I'll see you next time on your daily renewal.